Hi guys, it's Elbow here and welcome back to another video and in today's video before we even get started just wanted to say thank you for the support on the channel lately we're almost at 3,000 total viewers which is like insane for my channel and we've had lots of likes and dislikes um, but yeah I don't really mind if you dislike the video because in how I see it really um, it's better to dislike or like the video than just leave it so yeah um, today I'm not actually going to be doing a video on my ultramarine assault intercessors so that will probably be coming on monday or tuesday or somewhere in the week hopefully i won't leave it too long but yeah um normally i do weekly videos but for the ultramarines i'll probably do them a little bit later on a little later on a little bit earlier so yeah a couple of days apart so today i'm going to be unboxing something very new. So yeah, drum roll. Um, that wasn't intentional. Um, I wasn't actually supposed to drop the camera by drum doing the drumming. But yeah. Um, basically, what I'm going to be unboxing today is the GC PS slash Plague Hornets because I think there's a Plague version of this as well. But yes, here it is. And honestly, I'm not even going to show you anymore because I I know I've done quite a few unboxings. Um, and by now I know that there is a glare now, so I'll just show you um, the unboxing like this way basically, so let's get into that. So here is the Hornet dropship, um, obviously it's GCPS, um, I'm probably going to be converting this into a, a forge for the Hornet, I just thought why not, but yeah. Um, moving around, to this part. Um, just all that stuff, um, just if you are not English or American or whatever, I can't read that. But yeah, I'll be back. Obviously it's going to be the same sort of stuff, just a couple of close-ups on the weapons and stuff like that. So yeah, let's get into this box. Let's go. So you've seen a couple of close-ups on the box, so now I'm going to open it. So let's get into that. So guys, the wrapper has now been taken off. Now let's actually get into the box. So guys, everything in the box has now been taken out. So yeah, as you can see, I'll obviously do a little close up in a minute. But yeah, as you can see, this is like the stand for the Hornet. So yeah, you got that. And then we've got all of these pieces. Now, I've never actually, apart from the stone hammer, I've never actually, uh, like such a big model like it probably won't even be that big but, like this is the biggest model that I'm probably gonna have to put together so yeah I'll try and do that but first I must show you the pieces let's get into that okay we have all the pieces in its beautiful glory um, I don't actually know where any of these pieces will go on the hornet but yeah uh, that looks like it would be a wing I guess I'm guessing Where's the other one? Uh, yep, that's the other one. That, obviously the front. And it's got some... Oh, yeah, that probably goes in there, I'm guessing. Do that in a minute. Yeah. And we have all sorts of stuff that we have to put together. Let's get all of this out. Some bits on the top. Let's see. I've got um, weapon guns and stuff on there, like that. Just like that. Not taking each individual part out, but yeah, here's a little closer button on all of the pieces. As you can see, weapons there, got the wings, the the front. But yeah, she like it's going to be a decent sized model. Okay guys, now I'm going to try my best to put the Hornet together. So uh, let's get into that. So first, I've browsed all the pieces, so I kind of know what's what. This is the tail of the Hornet. So I need to find the other piece. Where is the other piece? It's there. Um, don't put these together. If because It could be a little tutorial for you as well, if you if you've got the Hornet as, like me. Um, don't put them together yet. Um, 
first you get this. I don't know what these are called. It's really, it's really bugging me. But they're they're like the things off the Avengers heli carrier. They're like propellers. I'm just gonna call them propellers. I'm probably just. I just won't call them anything. But um, yeah. Uh, this goes in. Just like that. There's two grooves there for the two um bits on the side, and then they go in there in place. And then it's really satisfying. What am I speaking? Um, it's really satisfyingly goes together. So yeah, that's in like that now. And then next, we need to get the two pieces for the body. There, put them together, just like so. And then we need the front bit, um, which is actually upside down. There we go. And actually, you need to try and get the clicking noise for it to go together properly. And it's still not doing that. Click together. There we go. So yeah, that's together now. Starting to look a lot like the Hornet. Definitely want to put them both together like that. Really satisfying. Goes together. And then we need the bottom part because obviously there's a massive gap at the bottom. Put that in place like that. And there we go. Starting to look a lot like the Hornet. Moving on. To the wings. Before we put the wings on, we need to put the. Oh, I'm not even gonna say it because I might, I might be wrong. But like the propeller things, put them in there like that. But first, obviously they're really loose. Um, you need these bits. I don't know which way they go. I'm just gonna put them a random way. But they go in just like that. Just click together. I'll show you with the second one. A little close up on it. So. Put them together, two little groovy bits there. And then we need the bit to hold it to here. And then, oh, it's going to fall together if I show you too close. But then, there's two little holes there, which then goes in play. Wait, I need to do it a bit closer, sorry. Go in. Okay, guys, I put it together now. Nicely in there, and it still has the movement. And then, Make sure to get the right wing. Nicely put it together. Oh God, that's gonna fall together. Obviously, it hasn't been glued. Go in there. There we go. Makes a weird noise when it goes together, but and then the other wing. It goes in a lot easier with this little bit, this gap here, than the front gap. So you have to put a little bit more pressure on it. For it to go in. There we go. It is starting to look a lot like the Hornet on the box. Without that happening. So guys, next is these little bits that go onto the wing. Um, make sure you put the right one on for the right wing. So yeah, they don't actually um, stay on, they, they will fall off. Actually, no, it's staying on. They will fall off probably soon. But yeah, we'll pop these on. Where does this one go? Um, this goes here, like that. This one's not staying on as easily, but yeah. Oh God. So guys, we've done um, probably the main body of it, but now, um, oh yeah, I thought so, uh, where are the wings? There should be some wings, yeah, they're, they're the wings, they keep coming off though, but they just go on the back tail, just like that, this one, the right one keeps coming off, but it just goes in like that, but yeah, um, the next thing is the troop transport, like, container bit. So we get this bit, then we get this like ammo box type thing, then we put it, it just clips on like that, doesn't it? And then, turn that round, and then we put this in. And then we've got these like, what, the door bit that where everyone sits, these aren't the door obviously, but this is just like, the two sides and then 
we'll just keep them in place like that. It's going to be quite hard to keep them in place. But then... The door piece, a really nice door piece, clicks on to there, it should, and then I can just stay in place for a couple more minutes, seconds, not minutes, and then I'll clip this side on. So there, oh please stay together for just a second. So here we go, it's got the whole container there with the door and everything. So yes, it's the way we put this on. Um, is by um, when I put this on, there's a two little or the all the gaps in there. That is there, so I can clip um, the container on, hopefully. So yeah, just give me a second. So guys, it's obviously gonna fall down because it's not glued, but there it is. That's um, how it will lock um, with um, the, the transporter there. I'll just the camera forward so you can see it a little bit better but yeah um now there's a couple more little bits i want to put on um there's these two bits that should go on the sides in here i'll take it off now don't really need it but yeah um they go in like that and then this one goes in like that, so just for the side, so there's no more gap there. I should put that out of the way now. So yeah. So guys, this is the finished um, Hornet. Um, not fully finished, I've still got all these little bits, but I'm probably not going to do that in this video because I don't want it to drag on too long, and I still don't know where some of the bits go on the model. But yeah, um, this is basically um, the finished Hornet. Um, there will be another video of the painted version. So yeah, stay tuned for that. So yes, guys, if you did enjoy the video, please leave a like and subscribe. See you later, guys. Bye.